This year I have been experimenting with hairstyles a lot. Today I thought of sharing some quick and easy ballet core hairstyles inspired by Pinterest queens like Cindy Kimberly and some of my favorite K-pop idols. All of these hairstyles are natural hair, wavy and curly hair friendly. I mean all of these hairstyles are either ponytails or braided hairstyles so your natural hair texture doesn't really matter. Prior to this I straightened my hair just because I want to if you want to see my full hair straightening and hair care routine i have made an entire video on that you can check that out before starting always comb through your hair making sure there aren't any knots or tangles i do think a rat tail comb is a must have since it's gonna save a lot of your time i am a lazy girl and if something a lazy girl recommends just trust that it's not even about saving time it's about saving a lot of energy especially if you rarely opt for center parting like me the end of the rat tail comb is very thin and it's gonna make sure your partition is very precise after parting take all of that hair and secure it in a ponytail i like my ponytail to be very very high like high ponytail and that's mainly because it suits my face shape round face people know what i'm talking about we don't have that chiseled jawline or cheekbones and our face is pretty flat in the front so when i create that high ponytail it kind of creates that illusion of a high cranial top and we do need a high cranial top uh, you can go for that flat headed ponytail but that doesn't suit a lot of people especially me in conclusion high cranial top just makes you look cute and to add to that lightly pull some hair at the top and just mess with it i have short hair and whenever i wear ponytails shorter hair at the back of my head just falls down so i'm securing it with a regular snap clip setting your baby hair in place will just overall make it look more cleaner and defined it's almost like applying concealer under your eyebrow area to make it look more pronounced today's star of the show are these satin ribbons i have like four to five colors and please do not order these online amazon and basically everywhere on the internet they hike up the price so much uh, just go to your nearby stationery or grocery mart any fancy stores you will get like a roll of satin ribbon for like 20 rupees or even less than that that's how much i paid i'm going to make use of this pre-cut white colored satin ribbon i used it in another video so i'm just gonna reuse it now tie it up make a knot you can just leave it like this it's giving me y2k early 2000s movie kind of a style hair sprays are like makeup setting spray for your hair if you want that pinterest like sleek and clean finish then a few spritz of hair spray here and there will give you that neat and clean look i wanted a bow hairstyle so i tied a basic bow and that's it this is the finished look the next hairstyle is probably one of my favorite hairstyles still now and it is inspired by new jeans i'm talking about this nymph hairstyle that they featured in asap uh, music video now this is what we are going to do first section the hair and take two portions of hair from the middle and braid those two portions while i do that let's talk about my makeup today for my lips i used wet and wild lip liner in chestnut that lip liner is sold out everywhere and i'm kind of freaking out if you know you know that if a certain product goes out of stock wet and wild never brings it back this has happened not once twice a contour and highlight duo palette was sold out and it was out of stock for months and they never restocked it it also happened with the wet and wild photo focus concealer in medium deep tan which was my perfect concealer match that was completely sold out only to be never restocked kind of freaking out because this is my holy grail lip liner i filled the center with the peripera ink velvet tint in 23 and i topped it off with unleash a 
glacier lip balm in blue lagoon and this is like a glitter coated lip balm so the glitter on my lips it's from the glacier lip balm on my eyes we have lilac shimmer from a very old palette from Huda Beauty this is the rose pastel obsessions palette I applied it on my eyelids and drew a short wing and that's it after braiding those two portions I was setting the baby hair with hair gel this time last hairstyle it was kind of like a natural finish this time since my hair is let loose I thought of creating like a curtain kind of a style with those baby hair pink versus white satin I went with pink hoping it would suit my lilac eyeshadow if you have never done ribbon hairstyles always cut the ribbon long enough and then tie a bow if the ribbon is way too short then you might have to throw it away and start from scratch I was kind of tired that day so I eyeballed the measurements and it kind of worked this is such a cute nymph hairstyle if you have square round or oval face shape this is gonna accentuate your face shape a lot I love it so much clearly this is one of my favorite amongst all of the other hairstyles today because I was taking a lot of pictures for the next hairstyle you're gonna create a half updo ponytail or what I call the Kylie Jenner ponytail it reminds me of 2017 King Kylie you know snapchat era every time I wear these I'm reminded of that hairstyle of Kylie's now we are gonna take a powder blue satin ribbon and tie a knot or even two knots and then braid the hair after braiding secure the ends with black disco bands the ribbon was a little too long so I cut it off to match my hair length I kept it messy because the last two hairstyles were very clean and poised this one is more coquette than ballet core here's how it looks I got lazy and tired so for the last hairstyle let's do something very simple low effort more like no effort I'm gonna recycle the same half of the ponytails first tie a knot and then a cute little bow and this is how it looks this is giving fairy core than ballet core and it will literally take you less than five minutes all of these hairstyle <laughs> might remind you of your childhood <laughs> your school days this is my first hairstyle tutorial. I loved creating these and I felt so good at the end. A little tired, but you know, that good, accomplished, productive feeling. What do you think about these types of videos? Do you like it or do you hate it? Tell me in the comments down below. I will see you later. Bye guys.